Hi there, and welcome to this week's video. So today I'm going to talk about compassion for all. And that means all including yourself so here's the deal we're at that time of year we're at that time of year when the focus is on you know giving and um, giving love giving care giving compassion giving presence giving 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 right this is the time where we know that not our focus is outwards on our loved ones on those that are less fortunate than us and there's just a whole ton of like outward energy towards everyone um, else, right? Our loved ones, what are the gifts, what are the, the offerings, what are the celebrations we're going to have for them and put in place for them? We look to those that are less fortunate and how can we give to them and help make this time of year a little bit happier for them? So it's all about this outward energy of giving love, care, and compassion. Now, we also know that statistically, it can also be the saddest time of year for many people. Depression and anxiety gets up during this time of year, and you know, things like suicide rates and everything else are super high this time of year. And there's a reason for this. There is a connection between those two things because we know now, and I have seen it over and over again with myself and with my clients, that when we keep the focus out there, even in the name of love and care and concern, but when the focus is on others, we start to lose track of ourselves, our uh, just wisdom over how we're showing up, um, the love, care, and compassion for self because we're pushing all of it out and not bringing any of it in for ourselves. And so uh, it, it has been proven time and time again that bringing focus to self is the strongest thing we can do to combat depression, anxiety, stress, worries, um, making choices that aren't great for us that in the long term end up biting us, things like this. So here's the solution to this. Yeah, I'm not saying don't they want, like continue to show love, care, concern for others, but please, please, please don't forget yourself. You are part of the all. You are also a part of the all. So here is this week's tip and um, action for you to take when it comes to this. Um, number one, take three to five minutes every day, just a few minutes to really sit down and focus on your successes. What did you do right today? What did you do that made you feel good and happy and proud and successful? Like really acknowledge, take time to focus on your individual successes for the day, all of them. And really, and if you're struggling with that, that's where the three to five minutes comes in. Set a timer and sit there until the alarm goes off and really sit down and either write or mentally or however you do it, really start to focus on your successes, your pride, your achievements, the things that you have done that made you happy and healthy and wonderful today. So really setting that focus on self. And then yes, of course, then take time and send compassion out to all, to all, and I mean all, all the people, even the ones that ticked you off that day, even the ones that cut you off in traffic or got a little bit too close without a mask on or whatever those things are that like really stressed you out, really find that self or find that compassion, love and care to send to all, including and especially those people that it, it's difficult for us to do that. And then step number three is sending compassion to self bring that compassion back. If you didn't handle yourself in a proud way to that person that cut you off on traffic, send that compassion to self too. Just as we say about others, oh man, it, maybe it was a rough day for them. Maybe that's why they did that. Bring that back too. It triggered me and I did something that I'm not proud of, but we all do that. I am human. I'll try and do better tomorrow. So those are your tips today to really round out this season to make sure you're including yourself into that love, care, and compassion, three to five minutes of celebrating all of the awesomeness that you were each day. 
taking some time to send compassion to all, even those that it's super difficult to do so. And step three, then bring all of that compassion back to self, even for those times that you weren't especially proud of your actions. Please let me know how this is going for you. Let me know if you start this practice, but you're having a difficult time maintaining it. Reach out to me. Let me know how all of this is going for you. And if I can help in any way, just let me know. Also, be sure to let me know if there's a topic that you would like me to talk on. Bring it. Bring it. And, and I'll do one of these videos just for you. Um, and yeah, like, share, comment, do the things, do all the things that you're supposed to do to get this action and this work and this compassion out. Let's get this stuff out there so that more and more people are focusing on the positives and making big, awesome changes in their own lives so that they can serve their family and friends better. Thanks so much. I will see you next week.